Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. It's been a while. I took a little bit of time off. I hope no one's mad at me. But yeah, today I'm back with kind of a mini vlog, like a self-care vlog. It's like the afternoon now, it's like half two. But I thought I'd start this because I'm having a self-care afternoon. I know my mental health hasn't been great lately, so I'm kind of taking the afternoon to myself. I'm going to have a bath, I'm going to do some like full-on skincare because I'm getting stress spots on my forehead again, if you can see. Got myself a cup of tea. I'm just gonna chill now. I've been, I've been chilling all day. I went out for a walk this morning. I got some wax melts, which I'll show you in a sec. I watched the film Coraline. Yeah, I know, not really a chill film, but I love that film. So, yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do now. I think I'm just gonna like chill on my bed for a bit because I feel like I've been around people all day and I need like a bit of time to myself. So here's my little bag of wax melts. So I've got 12 in here, it was 12 for £5 or like, I think it was 25 for 10 but I would not need 25 so I got 12. I'm not entirely sure what flavours these <laughs> flavours. I'm not sure what scents these are, obviously I chose them all out myself and like each box had labels on but when you put it in the bag obviously you don't know. I know there's like a black cherry in there somewhere, raspberry, strawberry and cream. There's a sweet peach as well which I'm excited for. Yeah, I can smell like strong scents now. So yeah, I'll obviously put one of those on there. You can see my little like stress animals here. <laughs> um, right, so now I'm gonna go make my bed. I stripped it this morning, just felt like I needed a freshen up. So yeah, I'm gonna go make that. All right, so I've made my bed. I'm just gonna have a general tidy up now, I think. Then I'm gonna go put Animal Crossing. I think my obsession at the moment. We've got a Nintendo Switch recently. Got Animal Crossing. I'm obsessed. I literally play it so much. It's like peaceful and calming and it calms my anxiety. I love it. So now I'm gonna go and have a nice, long, relaxing bath, take my book in. I can't put bath bombs in the bath bar. I can, but it like tears my skin apart because of wet eczema. So what I do, I use bath salts and stuff like that. It's like a detox one, it smells quite nice as well. I think I got it from the German market. We love the German market. I also love using this, it's from the body shop. I got it in like a Christmas range one year. It's like a berry scent, berry bonbon, very sweet. Love it, it's like bubble bath. I'm gonna use some of this as a body scrub to get any excess fake tan off because I might fake tan tonight to just feel good about myself because <laughs> I haven't been feeling great about myself lately. So yeah, I'm gonna go fill up my bath water. <laughs> So as you can see, I'm out the bath, I'm all snuggled up. I'm just going to do some skincare now because my skin just needs some care. And doing skincare kind of makes me feel like I've got my life together. Like, slap her face mask on for 15 minutes and I'm like, wow. This girl knows what she's doing when I don't. Okay, I'm going to use my Pixie Milky Tonic. Just a little bit of a toner, cleanser. Get any dirt off my face. I literally have more makeup in days. It's kind of mad. I barely wear my makeup these days, I'm just not feeling it. I can't have the energy for it long. Mm, yeah, so what's been going on with me? I've just been feeling a bit down, like, mentally. I think it's because it's coming towards September, and normally in September I'm off to school, off to college, you know. And this September there's no kind of set plans. 
So the plan originally was to have a gap year to either get a new job or just carry on with my old one, depending if I got any offers. But basically my old job had to let me go because of corona. Um, and nowhere else wants to hire me and my friend everywhere. So at the moment I'm kind of like jobless in a way. Like I've got, I do have like a temporary kind of job where I do like kids birthday parties every now and again. But obviously that's not like a stable income. It's just weird because like everyone that I know they've either got jobs like already kind of planned or they know like the dates they're moving to uni and stuff and I just kind of feel like I'm stuck in it and I don't know it's just it's really got me down and that and like a lot of other things that I'm not really going to get into but yeah I think that's all settled in. I'm going to put my face mask on. This is the Revolution Skincare London Jake Jamie Feed Your Cake. <laughs> Feed Your Cake. Feed Your Face Coconut Mango and Chia Seed Mask. I've only used this a few times. I literally got this for Christmas. I've got loads of Revolution skincare for Christmas that I've barely been using. I'm not like, it's quite bad. I have too much skincare. And I was going to use this brush. This smells so fruity. It's just going to... Oh, that matches my hair. Oh yeah, I forgot to say, I've got ginger hair. <laughs> I think you've noticed, but I forgot to kind of bring it up. Yeah, I'm ginger again. Plan on staying ginger for a while. Ginger was just like... Me as a ginger, she's just like another level compared to me as a blonde or me as a brunette. Me as a brunette has been a thing, if you didn't know. I've honestly had every single hair colour. Oh, it's so cold. This feels so good on my skin. I can probably apply too much, but it's fine, it's fine. Good, there was pesky stress. What's what is my hand doing? Oh, guys, look at my nails as well. Aren't they so pretty? I got them done. This girl, well, I saw her on TikTok, like, someone went to her and she literally lives, like, kind of the nearest big city to me, Birmingham. So I went to her and she literally did these insane nails that were, like, £13. Yeah, I will link her Instagram down below. She's amazing. She's actually 15 years old. Like, she's not professionally trained, but she didn't claim to be, you know. So, yeah, she's really good at clouds. I look so nice. I'm going to leave that on for, like, 10 minutes. And... I used to use like clay masks but they dry my skin out so much. I have oily skin but it can go dry like at the click of my fingers so I've got to be like so careful. So yeah I'm just going to leave that on. I'm just going to like put her around for a bit now. I need to hurry up my bedroom because I've got all my stuff out from my bath. I never put away. I'm so messy. Oh, So it's been like 15 minutes. I'm going to take this off now. It doesn't like dry down or anything because that would irritate my skin. <laughs> um... I can't be bothered to go and wash it off, so I'm just going to use a face wipe. This is literally what I've been like recently. Like, I'm too tired to do anything. Like, I'll start doing stuff, and then I won't finish it like this. But, you know, it's fine. We've got our prime wipe makeup wipes. This is why I have makeup wipes, to be honest. Like, I use them to, like, clean up my makeup. And for when I'm, like, too lazy to get my makeup I just drop my... These are biodegradable as well, which is really good, because we need to save the environment. My skin looks so glowy. Oh yeah, we love that. That's all the skin I'm going to do for a moment, just because I want to give my skin a little break. Um, I also need to moisturise my body, but I'm too cold to do that, so I'll do that later. So I've been chilling for a bit. I'm going to go fake tan now. But first, moisturise is key. I'm using this one at the moment. It's very good for my eczema because I do have really bad dry skin and eczema, which is very annoying for fake tan, which is why I like to use kind of gradual moisturiser ones because these don't show up on any dry patches I have more, which is why I obviously moisturise. And I'm going to use this one on my face. This is the Revolution Skincare CBD Rich Nourishing Queen. Queen. <laughs> I've lost the ability to speak. Yeah, I'm going to go moisturise and put tan on. I'm not going to show you because yeah you're not gonna be seeing me in my underwear um yeah oh, i'm such a mess okay i've done my body i'm just gonna show you how i do it on my face I think the brush isn't the best brush but i kind of buff it in just like all over you know the key with fake honey is to make sure you actually like rub it in properly because i can get a bit lazy sometimes i feel so much more confident with tan as well I always bring it down the neck. I've already done my body as well and I've like moisturised and that. And then a little bit on the forehead. And I'm just going to put it like on the bits of my face that are contour to kind of give them a bit of extra product. 
to hopefully add some definition. This does normally work. Watch it not work. Like vlogging. And I find this doesn't bury me out either. This one or McGonny A1. I use both of those depending on my mood. I'm bring it down the neck. Alright, I'm gonna go drink my cup of tea. I'm like my fifth cup of tea of the day. I have a problem, I know. Alright, so while my tan is developing and I'm drinking my tea, um, let's have a little chat about YouTube, right? Oh, my finger. Um, obviously I'm continuing with YouTube. I just had a little break. The problem is with me, like, I have video ideas and like I've got so many videos like cases researched but i just i can't make myself like sit down to film sometimes if i'm not in the mood and i did film a few videos but i just was not myself and i wasn't happy and i don't want to put those out on the internet so yeah just know i haven't been like slacking i have been researching it's just getting down to film sometimes which is why i'm kind of doing a vlog style video just because i don't really have to like set up and properly film with the ring light and stuff it's more chill which, yeah, but I mean, I'm going to try and aim to get back to at least two videos a week. Probably not three. Hopefully two, though. Yeah, I'm just going to drink my tea while my tan settles in. Obviously, it's not going to, like, be dark instantly, but we move. I'm going to do one of my wax melts now. I don't even know which one to do. I've literally got to name my drawer as well for one of my friend's businesses as well. Ah. I'm going to do it like a raffle. Um, I'm going to close my eyes and just pick one. All right, I'm going to put my hand in my bag. Pick this one. Alright, pop that in. I need to get a new tea light as well. Where are my tea lights? In. That's not smooth at all. There we go, she's in, lads. And I've got my chakras. Yeah, I need to find a new home for these because they won't be out here forever. Oh my god. I was actually just like chilling around my bed. Just turn my wax melt on. I see a flash, a massive spider. I had a massive spider a few weeks ago, but it was bigger than that one. <sighs> we got it now, we got it. Um, yeah, so the wax melt is melted. <laughs> it smells divine. I don't really know what it is, but all of my scents are pretty much the same that I got. All variations of like sweet things like raspberry, strawberry and cream, <laughs> cherry. <laughs> so like it's nice, yeah. Also, if anyone watched my Primark haul, I'm wearing the dramas from those because I am. <laughs> because I remember I said in that like, we good for fade tan. Cheers. So yeah, I don't really know what I'm gonna do for the rest of the night. It sounds bad, but I wanna catch up on YouTube because I have barely been on YouTube lately. And um, I know Eleanor Neal's posted quite a few videos lately. I might binge watch her for a bit. It is like 10 o'clock, but you know, YOLO. So yeah. Oh my god, I look so rough. Yeah, I ended up falling asleep. It's a second half. It's literally like half ten now. Oh, you can tell I've just been asleep. Yeah, I was gonna like read my book a bit, but I've just remembered. I would drive a lesson tomorrow. It's half eight in the morning. <sighs> Which, yeah, I'm gonna have to go to sleep early for that because your girl needs her beauty sleep, as you can tell. So, yeah, I'm gonna sign off. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you take anything from it, then please take care of your mental health. And yes, like skincare and like having a bath can really help your mental health. But like the best thing is to just take a break from life if you can. Um, to cry, crying helps mental health as well. I think. Like sometimes just like feeling emotions and like letting the emotions kind of like letting yourself feel sad for a bit instead of being like no one to be happy. Like if you let yourself kind of sit with the sadness for a bit, then. That kind of helps. Yeah, I'm not a therapist, but I'm going to say this. Alright, I'm going to. Bye, guys. <laughs>